In a series of fiery events that unfolded with stunning intensity. Are you serious? Help! No, 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 relax, for what? Relax, I want to call relax, your service. Relax, no, how? Relax, no, relax, relax. No, You're being detained. No, Listen. No. These incidents thrust ordinary days into electrifying chaos and unveiled the unexpected twist. Turn around! Turn around! Oh, what the f dude? Why am I under arrest? I didn't even do anything! Experience the breathtaking thrill of these eye-raising crime incidents that will leave you astonished at every turn. Starting with this chaotic arrest, this woman's wig wasn't just a disguise. It became a crucial clue that unraveled a dramatic twist. We are we are police. Why are you scared of police? Only bad people are scared of police. Sir, I I grew up in a bad neighborhood and, and I've I've seen police shoot people in their back while they run away. On the 20th of September, 2023, the sheriff's office issued a warrant for a local resident in Monroe County. Upon approaching, the officers voiced their concerns with the female and took appropriate measures without wasting any time. How are you doing? Sorry. Are you Darla? I know. I know. Is there anyone else in the car with you, ma'am? No. Okay, I have a warrant for you. What? For that, for the, the light that was out? Not, no, it's a warrant. It was a light that was out, a headlight. No, it's a marine violation. I have to check it, a okay? A marine violation? I'm gonna double check, I'm gonna verify everything, but this, this My is My food that I, I sold? If this is the case, you're gonna have to go with me tonight. You're joking. I'm not. You're being detained for no, no ma'am, please. No, no, no. Are you, are you, what? Are you serious? Help! No, Stop. No, no. Stop. no, for what? Relax. I want to call your service. No, help! Relax, no. relax. No. relax. No. You're being detained, no. listen. No, what is going on? No, 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 no. Relax, Thank relax. Can you call your resisting. sergeant? No, okay, I'm gonna, can we talk? That works. I'm not being we, detained. We will talk. Can we, we talk? We, no, listen, we will detain you, okay? We are gonna verify everything. Okay. Can I get my wallet, my ID? Treat me like a human being. You're resisting. Come okay. on. All right. You know what? I will. All right. My dad fought for this country. Call your sergeant now. My dad is a Marine. He, this is crazy. Call, call your sergeant now. Call your sergeant now. You guys are so aggressive. I, I want your badge numbers. I want all the information on everything. I'm pissed, bro. Do you know who I am? Most of the front of my car. So this is the deal, okay? I told Get you, your arm off me. I told you what's going on, okay? You, you guys are supposed to serve and protect, right? Is this serving and protecting? No, you guys have some bad guys to go catch? This is crazy. Go cut, ahead. Cut this crap. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay? No, go ahead. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so far sergeant. away to charge you who we're resisting, okay? Call your sergeant. She attempted to escape her fate by flaunting a powerful connection, but her efforts were futile. Tango 14 to 1102. What's your location? She wanna see you. Copy. Thank you. Charter school. All right. Um, my, that, that my children go to charter school. Okay. Uh, what's your date of birth? That's me. What is that for? I'm gonna talk to you in a second. Let me get information about your warrant, okay? It's okay. So what I can, uh, uh, what I'm doing now, uh, I'm gonna verify with the dispatch if the warrant is still active. But it looks like I'm gonna have a warrant for a conservation environment uh, 
violation of dumping leader over 500 pounds. I didn't do that. I it's don't know a, it's where. A, it's a $5,000 dollar bond. I, I okay? sold that your bond. Warrant, I've already sold the bond. Your warrant I... is issued in the county of Monroe, county of Dade, Broward and Collier. But I sold the boat. I haven't been on that boat in months. Well, ma'am, you need to understand I have nothing to do with the warrant. Basically, I understand. What I have to Shouldn't do... Shouldn't I got something in the mail or something? This is My kids go to school tomorrow. This is crazy. So that's what's going to happen, okay? If they're going to verify the warrant is active. Can I... Can you please call your sergeant? Thank you for thinking go ahead. Can you please call your sergeant? I'm asking. I'd like to talk to somebody. A firm, yes. I'd like to talk to somebody, please. Oh. I've never been in trouble a day in my life. This is so aggressive, bro. Hey, I pick up trash from okay. my kids' school. I would right. never litter. So I, I talk to my sergeant, hey, right now. Hey, I you my send freaking for life. Please. So okay, so I contacted the sergeant. I let him know you would like to talk to him. He's right now in the Please. Stock Island. Thank you. He told me if the warrant is gonna be verified, he can talk to you whenever I'm gonna take you to jail. No, I can't. Yes, go to that's jail. how it works. Apparently, the female didn't give up and continued her efforts. Nonetheless, the police remained resolute. It's a court document signed by judge. I don't have an option to take you to jail. Okay, just sit tight for now. The warrant is not verified yet, okay? I'm waiting for the, this patch is working on it, okay? Also, you're gonna get uh, resistance charge. I don't even know what the, the, the letter, what is that? Can I, I be explained? I, I don't know, I'm not the one who issued the warrant. I don't know, maybe I FWC, do my, my guess would my, be... My, my okay. husband works for CETO. Okay, it, it, does, it, does, it doesn't matter, matter, okay? It's crazy. I don't know who... I sold the okay. book to somebody else, okay. though. But if this was so, a misunderstanding, so this is, this is something, I'm suing, because this is crazy. So this, this is something you have crazy. to take, this is you have to take the tour. Okay. I am I know, but I'm having a panic attack, sir. I can't just listen to what he's got to say, all right? I can't go to jail though. Like I, can't, I cannot. I'm a real estate agent. Well, if the warrant is active, there's no choice. I, no I, choice for you. No choice for us. I can't imagine. I'm gonna have a nervous breakdown. There's no way. There's no way I can go to jail. There's no way. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to show a house on Saturday. How does this work? I don't know. Understand? Well, you have a five thousand bond. Okay, what if, if you're poor? If you, if you can post the bond, uh, they're going to release you um, on the bond. Like, how is that? This is, this is, uh, uh. So that's how it works, okay? I don't know who issued the warrant. I believe, my guess is it's related to the board that it was uh, FWC. Yeah, but that, I Warren, sold the listen boat. to me. Can you I wanna, prove that you wanna, I sold you, it? You, you Can I prove that I sold it? But that's not gonna, it's not gonna be here on the traffic stop. That's not how it works. You're gonna have to prove it in the court, okay? You can talk to judge. Okay, for, for, now, for now what I know, judge sign a warrant for your arrest. You're being charged with the offense I told you. If you're telling me that you sold the boat. I did. It's not gonna change anything what's going on tonight because that's not how it works. No, I can't go but you're gonna, you can, you can fight it in the court. I, I know, but I, I can't, there's no way I can be booked in process. There's no way, like that, I, that cannot happen to me. No freaking way, dude. No way. Thank you so much. I never thought this would happen in my life. Are you putting him on tighter? What, why? Why? Why would you put him on tighter? We're gonna change. Oh, We're gonna Jesus. change head caps You know they did this to Jesus. I don't. I guess. I don't know. Just wait, wait. This is, can I call my dad? Can I call my okay. mom? Okay, you're gonna be allowed to do it while still waiting for Warren to be called here. Why are you okay? putting out another yeah, handcuff? I'm, I'm, I'm just changing handcuffs. We're changing handcuffs, okay? Panic Grab your keys, alright? I want to. Your car keys? Yes. Right. Why are you taking them? You can't have them in your hands, right? So right now we are not in the custody, you are just detained, okay? I'm still waiting for... What am for... I being detained for? I told you, they're suspicious you have a warrant. I thought you guys like catch bad guys, this is crazy. So if you, if you well, have... We are, okay. we are people so with So can warrants. I ask you a question? We are people with Why warrants. Why don't they let you know that you have one? Well, like shouldn't it be something in the mail or a phone call or... 
contact you? What if you don't know that? Well, they, take it, take it with court, not That's with us. Crazy, okay? We though. are not the one who is issuing warrants. I understand, warrants. but I just, I, I, like, can you give me like a, a card, a name, a number, something? This is, this is traumatic. This is really bad. Well, it's bad that you resisted. Well, you scared me. You grabbed my arm. I, you hurt me. That's that's a resistance charge. I understand, but aren't you supposed to like ask who I am, ask for my ID? Ma'am, I approach you. Ask, I I ask you, you Dayla, right? Whatever your first name is. I explain you, you what's going me. on. It's I explain you what's going me. on. But it scared me. I try to detain you. You I start pulling away for, you for me. me. You start fighting with you us. That's a resisting. Me. Okay. You scared me. I we are we are police. Why are you scared of police? Only bad people are scared of police. Sir, I I grew up in a bad neighborhood and, and I've I've seen police shoot people in their back while they run away. Some well, some people they don't get trained and they have trauma. I used to work in trauma, medical. So you try to fight those cops and I hope that no, you're not gonna be shot, shot in the in not, the back. Not saying right? but I, I I'm not gonna argue. Soon, the cops conducted an extensive search of her belongings, outlining the upcoming procedures. Um, Can I get my phone? Can somebody grab my phone on the top of my phone? Uh, we're going to take your phone, yes. Yeah. Anything else you want? Like no. No, just phone. You don't, no. don't want to... Just the phone on top. How about wallet? Shoes. No, I don't want nothing. Okay, we're going to take a wallet, too. Okay. I don't have a wallet. I just lost my ID. This is Copy, crazy. thank you. I'm going to switch back to one. So you wanna take shoes with you? No. No. Oh, I can't fine. believe this is happening. This way, yep. Can I get my hair? Yeah, I'll, I'll grab it. Please. Can, grab I, it for you. can I get my phone? I think it's on top of the we, car. We're gonna oh, take your phone, yes. Can I? Oh my god, I cannot believe this. Alright, take a seat, please. I can't believe this. Can, did you call your sergeant? Can I talk to him? You're gonna be able to talk to him whenever you're gonna move south. No. He's in Stock Island. He's not going to come here. So he, he's not able to do anything. Since you have a warrant, he can change it too. Okay? Jail looks so dirty and gross and I'm not a criminal. Ma'am, my... I'm not saying you're a criminal. You're being charged with something. Doesn't mean you're guilty of it. But the bottom but line, me. the bottom line, I have to follow the judge. I understand. It's, it's a judge. It's not us. Okay? At this point, it's a judge. We don't have a choice. Is there alcohol I smell? Yeah, and a bunch of other other things too. Thank you. It's hot in here. Better now. Why do I smell alcohol? I, I mean, she's got she's got food in here too. That could be. He has what? She had she had like a. Ah, uh, be careful with trunk, okay? Because she has some. Look at this. Yeah. You don't want to probably open it because. Oh yeah, she's got a whole bunch of plates and. You don't want this felon break. If we, that's gonna fall. All right, I'm gonna go. Okay, uh, Tov is coming. Um, I'm sorry. Is it, can I call my dad? Uh, not now, but you're gonna be able to do this from the jail. Okay. So I'm gonna take your credit card, so you maybe you can post bond. I don't have any money. I okay, so you leave it in the car. You leave it in your purse. Yeah. Okay. Law enforcement was getting prepared for the upcoming tasks. I'm not drunk. Well, uh, you still have an open container. I'm not saying you're drunk. I don't believe you are drunk. But you're not allowed to have an open container of alcohol in the car. Alright. 
Uh, if you open it, like you said, all that's going to fall in the back. Yeah, there's nothing like just put a camera over there, what I could see. Okay. Just to be on the safe side, uh, do a tow and uh, transmit it. All right, thank you. Did you have my phone on top of the car? Uh, yes. Thank you. This one, right? Yes, sir. You get another one inside the car? No, I don't need that one. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate you being, I know you're just trying to do your job. But... Well, uh, too bad you resisted. Because you grabbed, you scared me. You grabbed my arm. Ma'am. I've never been. That's not, like that's that not how it works, okay? You, you scared me. Well, I, I I explain you what's going on before you know I try to detain you. Can you turn on the air, please? I don't have to go to Key West jail, do I? Uh, yeah, that's where we're going, no. ma'am. Oh it's an anchor, yes. No. The officers summarized her misconduct, hinting at the trouble she would soon face. All right, right behind is his supervisor, so I'm gonna let, let you talk to him. So, uh, so I pulled her over um, when she was stepping out. I asked her, uh, I called her by her name, and she said, how do you know it? I let her know what's going on, that looks like she is a warrant. I'm gonna have to send it for confirmation. If this is the, you know, this is the fact she's gonna have to go with me. Um, then I try to detain her. She start like uh, pulling, pushing away. Uh, nothing really crazy for just active resistance. Uh, me and Roja, we are controlling both ends, so we use um, as much less use of force as we do. That's why it took us so long to basically gain control over her. She just freaked out. Um, I believe that she wanna talk to you because she's claiming that she sold the bow and you know she's being unlawfully unlawfully arrested. Okay. It doesn't uh, doesn't like I can uh, uh, make a point to her that it's a warrant and you know we don't have a choice. I'm saying by a judge. Hi, how you Hello, ma'am. Are you uh, Darla? Is that your name? Yeah. All right, I'm sorry for you with the sheriff's office. What, um... There's been a mix-up. Um, I sold this boat a few months ago, and I think that's what that they're referring to, the sailboat that I sold to another individual at the marina. Okay. Um, and I'm... Was it your boat? It was, and I sold it. Yeah, I sold it a couple months and ago. And you, you did the whole sign the title and everything, everything and yep. made sure that person went down to the tag I mean, office and, and changed they it into didn't. their name? They obviously didn't, because yeah. that's why I, he, when he went to grab me, I'm like, what are you doing? Like, I've, not, I've never been in trouble in my life. This is the first time this has ever happened. I'm 35 years old. I'm, I'm an upstanding citizen. My kids go to <laughs> charter school. I have three kids. I'm married. My husband works for CETO and Marathon. Okay. And this is kind of... Well, getting, getting arrested doesn't mean you're a bad person. So whoever you sold that boat to mm -hmm. obviously dumped it somewhere. And because they, they never changed over the registration, yeah. the title, they believe the boat was still yours, which yeah. legally it is if they never turned the title over. So that's why I, I panicked and freaked out because I I'm, I was being unlawfully detained. Do, do, you, do you have any complaints related to the way we treat you over there? Like, yeah, you grabbed my arm, you were a little aggressive, and my hair fell off. Okay. And, All right. Okay. Uh, since we use a force, I guess I'm gonna have to charge her with resisting. You're gonna have to uh, make a use of force. Uh, or you just fill out the little use of force yeah, tab on the. Yeah, right. I'm saying I, uh, since we put the hands on her, you know, we don't have the choice to charge her with resisting. So, so you're gonna be, so you, you're being taken for warrant. Also, I'm gonna charge you with resisting, okay? And what do I do? Just like get a lawyer and prove that I. Um, as far as court, I mean, we can't take... give you legal advice, no, but yes, you should, you know, you should this contact some type of legal counsel to assist you. But I won't you. be, like, stuck here or anything, right? Um, does the warrant have a bond? The warrant has a 5,000, but if I'm not charged with resistance, she's probably going to have to stay to your uh, first appearance. Okay. Um, Do you think it's a little much? I mean... Do I? I? The judge sets the bonds, not us. That's, there's a judge that signed that warrant. Um, and just so you know, as deputies, as we're both deputies, but deputies or police officers, 
the the warrant says you must. So even if you believe it's a mistake, we don't have a choice. Law enforcement swiftly proceeded with the next course of action, adhering to protocol. Saying that there was probable cause to believe. I've never been in trouble my entire life. I'm 35 years old. I've never been. I understand. It's just it's humiliating. It's embarrassing. My hair fell off. And I just want to go home. Right. Ma'am, that wouldn't happen if you wouldn't resist. But I didn't do anything wrong. You may not have believed you did, but a judge signed a warrant saying that there's probable cause that you did. <sighs> because of a mix-up, but I'll, they'll get to the bottom of it. They will, they will, absolutely. Be careful, All right, ma'am, let's move uh, upstairs. Can I have my shoes, um, please? Uh, actually, I didn't take it now. You didn't get my shoes. Well, when I was grabbing your shoes... And my hair fell off. No shoes or hair. When just, I was grabbing okay. your shoes, we find open Can container. you please get some shoes for me? I have, they'll have shoes upstairs. I don't have any gonna shoes give you, to give you. Gonna give just you wait, just wait. I'm going to escort you over. Okay, just let me close it's the door, please. No shoes or hair. Right, this is crazy. Now, you can't just walk away because you don't have the ability to catch yourself if you fall. Okay, so one of us has to escort you. They did this to Jesus, you know. And he was not good. He was innocent. <laughs> Nobody is saying you're guilty of anything. No, but the way I was, you know, in handcuffs, it makes you feel like... You have a warrant for your arrest. No, but for something I didn't do. Okay, so what would now, what happens? Okay, we're going to walk over to the door and go upstairs. To this way. All right, listen, I'm, I'm just going to hold you, because like I said, if you fall over, you can't save yeah, yourself. Yeah, you can't save yourself. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. What are you saying? You have a gun on you. I'm not going up. I'm, okay. I'm going to... It says you, you must. It doesn't say you can't. If I, if I, I'm gonna. Like, call you and let you know you have a warrant or like send you a something. They should have sent you something in the wall, unless, it, I'm sorry, in the mail. Yeah, unless it was just signed within the last couple of days. I don't I know anything about anything the warrant. I, I don't know. It's uh, this case, like 5,000 something. So it's, thank you. So it has to be like, you know, a couple of months old. A case, and it's not a warrant. And, unless you didn't have the correct address on the title, they probably sent it to your old address. Yeah. Thank you, sir. The suspect was charged with misdemeanor, resisting an officer, obstruction without violence, and her felony warrant for conservation environment dumping litter over 500. Lastly, she was cited for having an open container of alcohol in her vehicle. Experience a thrilling pursuit through streets as this determined cop matches wits with a cunning fugitive. Check this out. On the 26th of July, 2022, the New Mexico State Police were notified by the U.S. Marshals that they believed a wanted fugitive was in the area. The police closely tracked the fugitive's every move. Rents, undeterred, showed no signs of slowing his relentless pace. Light hey, lights are on. So we got lit up. Uh, the police not stopping yet. So we're pulling into a residence. Get out! Get out! Ready? Can you handle comms? Come up to the left and turn it back on the highway going in westbound. Um, Highway, did you say red? We're going westbound on the highway.
1441 said come. I'm just passing Miller and Murray. He's ahead of me. Uh, he just went southbound on 371. I'll be first. 371, be kind. Should look at it. They're in the middle of the street there. Middle map. Uh, N36. Stand by. Stand by. 36. Working on N36. Going in. 1453 Centcom, um, stand by. Uh, N36 and has shipped up here in the now. We are going up the hill by the casino. Uh, westbound in the eastbound lanes, uh, coming up the hill. We're at the top of the hill now. Westbound. Lane. During the chase, tension sparked as the cops' unconventional tactics to stop rents fell short, causing a clash between vehicles. 21 mile marker right now, still westbound. All over, thank you, Abadine. If it gets slow enough, keep in mind at those speeds, dude, you guys are going to go off the road and eat it too. Your safety is more important than this idiot. So just wait. If you see the opportunity to make the move, make the move. If not, just keep riding, okay? Or probably won't be today on that 36 in time to the road 13 curve in. More of a dangerous uh... Just start planning me, be prepping him for that turn if he turns on 491 or he hits a dirt road. And keep in mind, he's going to come out shooting. Now for we're driving, and we're still westbound. We're trying to catch up to Lloyd and Sammy right now, but the guy's going probably over 90 miles an hour. Coming up to the 20 mile marker. Enforcement didn't give up, and their efforts translated into success in the end. What followed for Rents was beyond his worst nightmares. Fourteen five three, he's off the road. Driver, put your hands up! Get on the ground! Driver, get on the ground! Driver, get on the ground! Get on the ground, face down! Oh, 
Well, don't worry about double lock. Go and get your beagle apart. Anything? Check this side. Belt's What's wrong with you? All right, roll up on your knees. Put your knees up. Sit up on your. Stop, stop. You got him, Oliver? Yep. One copy that. Thank you. Second on 1453, one male, detained. There's Emma. 14 on you direct, gentlemen. Very good job. So much. B-10-8 at the command post, B-4, CP-1, 716 at the command post, 1619. Philibert Rents was charged with aggravated fleeing of a law enforcement officer, possession of a firearm as a felon, possession of controlled substance, and drug paraphernalia possession. He was booked into the San Juan County Adult Detention Center in Farmington on reportedly active arrest warrants in Colorado. Watch this man find himself in a tense game of hide and seek, holed up in a cluttered storeroom with two PlayStations as his loot. I'm trying, dude! These cuffs are fing tight, bro! <laughs> That's all, man. I just want the <laughs> On the 18th of September, 2023, the Pierce County Sheriff's deputies responded to an armed robbery at a GameStop. Arriving at the scene, the police briefed and prepared for the imminent action ahead. Tell me, 72, we go with that description one more time. White male, mid 30, six foot, thin build, gray hair, face tattoo, black hoodie, gold chain. Proceed. All right, hold on one second. Victim's next door. Yeah, he's right here. I'm sure you guys already know about the break-in last night. Oh, this is this is like this. Yeah, so this was already like this. This was last night. Yeah. Yeah. Um, someone drove through last night. Did he have a black backpack? He might have. He was walking on the radio down that way then. Yeah. What did he take? Uh, he made me open up the back. Told me he had a gun. Um, and he took a whole bunch of PS5 switch controllers. So he, um, he took PS5s, like multiple of them? Yeah. So did you, I mean, he would have he been. He had a backpack. I don't know if he's talking about backpack. How many PS5s? Uh, a couple, two, two PS5s, and um, okay. a whole bunch of controllers. All right, we'll be back. Wear a hoodie, right? That's a lot of stuff, yeah. Uh, these tattoos. Oh, and things. chains. If you want to talk to him, I'll go take a look real quick. See, he was heading, he was heading south. I don't think he was heading south. I'm not walking down. He has a free hoodie. He's okay. not a backpack. I'll take a look. Quickly, the cops enlisted a potent ally to bolster their investigation. Tensions rose as officers uncovered troubling clues. Dog's still working. Can't find a burger up in the neighborhood. How far down was it? It was just a little bit further than when we came in. It's on that corner down there, but... Mommy. On that side. Is anybody on the perimeter around 140th Street, just south of Fergo? Dogs indicating may have possibly jumped the fence near 9911 140th Street, 40th. So they came over the fence. This is 9911, uh, so 27 would be just that way, just a couple. I think there's a, I think there is that truck we can, you want to walk down that way. You want me to see if there's an access point this way? Yeah. I think it's not too much further because there's the end of the field right there. It should be. Is that locked? I can try. I can, might have a key to that one. Oh man! Call you the locksmith. 
Mm-hmm. That was easy because it wasn't locked, so. <laughs> okay, dog's coming out to one Fuego Street, at least. Law enforcement delved deep and unearthed an unexpected twist, both chilling and highly amusing. Maybe, I don't know. Swing is moving. Hello, the police. Please, show me your hands. Show me your hands. Come on. Show me your hands. Let me see 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 your hands. The kid tried throwing all this to the fence, bro. Ow, dude, what the f man? This is the one you guys don't got me on camera doing anything. I know you don't, because I didn't feel anything. Oh, he's stuff in there? Yeah, he was just sitting down facing. No, I mean the. Oh, what? Yeah, the dude was in here. No, but I mean the, the PlayStation. Oh, but... no, that's on the that's other side. Oh, you guys yeah. Oh, that's yeah, right. we got that. That's by my car on the oh, Virgo okay. side. You want to use your car? Oh, yeah. Man. We checked the next yard. I oh. looked over this man. <laughs> that's good eyes by Jet. <laughs> nice work. Randall fought desperately to evade his inevitable fate. Nonetheless, all of his efforts were in vain. Cuffs off! Stop! Get these motherfuckers cuffs off! They're gonna get these cuffs off me, homie! Get these cuffs off! Is that what we're doing? He's a s***ing assaulting me, Get these cuffs off me! Sir, we'd like you to calm down. Get these cuffs off me right now! You're under arrest. No, I'm not! Stop resisting. Get these motherfucking cuffs off me! You just busted my face open and my knees open, you piece of s***! Ah! You guys see this? You're assaulting me! Ow! Get these cops off me! You just broke my fing hand, you piece of sh! You broke my fing hand! Did you hear me? Yeah, you're screaming and I'm sitting right here. Get the fing off me! Six ten of you fing to take me down? Get these cuffs off me, dude. My hand's broken, bro. Stop, you broke my hand. I can't get up like that. Stop, I'm serious. You're not really cooperating with me. I will if you undo the Things off my feet, please. Uh, that, no, I promise you, I'll get up politely. I promise. Do I need to wrap it around again? Dude, dude, please. You, you can't. You can't. You broke my hand, dog. I'm serious. I'm serious. I'll oh, act polite if you undo them, please. I will right now, please undo them. My hand's broken, dog. I never did anything, man. I fell asleep in the shed, dude. I'll just go. I'm homeless, dog. I'm tired. I'm gonna uncross. There we go. With that. Oh, there we go. That's the step. Every time I fall asleep somewhere else, people still on my s***. Oh, 
older than me, you have to act like this to us. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Can you it? <laughs> no, it's not, dude. You slammed me on the pavement. <laughs> me first, dog. <laughs> oh, that's not, that's not my hands. I'll get up if you undo these off my feet politely, I promise you. I put that on everything I love, I promise. I swear yeah, to God, dude, I'm not shot? joking. I'm not gonna run or nothing. One, one shot, look at I me promise, shot. one yeah, shot, shot, please, one I shot. promise. One shot, one <laughs> shot. I'm not gonna run, dude, I promise. We can leave those on. Alright, we're on your side. Sit up. <laughs> oh, dude. Sit up. One, two, three! <laughs> One more chance! Stand up, 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 st
Randall was charged with felony counts of first-degree robbery, kidnapping, and unlawful imprisonment. The bail amount set for him remains unknown due to the limited court information. When this man crossed the line with a nurse, the police officers reminded everyone that respect is non-negotiable, regardless of the circumstances. Excuse me, ma'am, what are you touching me for? Because we're in a medication. Are you a doctor? I, I'm a nurse. Are you a doctor? I'm a nurse. You f***ing grab no nurse like that. On March 21st, 2023, officers responded to a disturbance report about Michael Paul Martin at a hospital in Atlanta. Upon arriving, Michael's actions created a scene that prompted police involvement. What's up? You're going to room 11. No record, no recording. No recording. Why are you I'm telling me that? I'm telling you that because there's people in here and they want their privacy. So, privacy. you know, HIPAA laws, you're not supposed to record patients in a hospital. Uh, you can't do that. Am I considered a patient at this point? You are a patient. Do you have documentation of that officer? You got yourself checked in. You checked yourself in. Remember? Yeah, I did. Yes, you did. Can you hear me? I don't know if you have audio hearing that, like I do or not. I'm just going to say thanks for your service, man. I gotta go. Please. What are you gonna do? Please. Officer McKinney. He's asking to have a seat. He's asking to have a seat, man. I know he's asking me to have a seat, officer. Is he authorized to do that? Yes. What's the title? Is she allowed to give me commands? Yes. Am I being detained against my will? Have I been praying us? I'm going outside, bro. No. Come back. Just stay in the room, man. Just stay in the room, So what's his status? Is he 1013 or No? I don't know what to Okay. I just hope you don't see him. That's why I wanted to see him in that room. He's just a malinger. He's just hanging around. If he wants to leave the hospital, then. He left and came back. Well, I mean, if he wants, to, if he wants to leave the hospital, then if he's not, he really don't want to. Huh? He really don't want to. I mean, if he wants to, if he wants to check himself hey, out, can I get, do you, do you want to check yourself out? I'd like to get visual confirmation that this is room is eleven. May I take two steps forward and look 11? there? Look, look, right there. Yep. Oh, now you're blind. Hey. So you you want to you want to you want to get checked in. You want to be seen. You're checked in. Have a seat and cooperate with them. You can hear me just fine. You're saying so many. You can hear me. You ready? Huh? Excuse me, ma'am. What are you touching me for? Because we're in a medication. Are you a doctor? I'm a nurse. Are you a doctor? I'm a nurse. We need your thigh. <laughs> That's funny, bro. Wait till they, yeah, they've done this three times now. For sure. Can you go ahead and medicate the wound, doctor? Nurse? Nurse, doctor? Sorry, I couldn't let you do that yourself, bro. Was she about to <laughs> Can you imagine how, like, how effed up my brain is after having done this for so many years and, like, a regular chemist not get properly serviced? Nurse. God, please give you specific instructions. Uh, Waiting on you. I don't Waiting need around. specific instructions. Okay, this could you my... please wipe my left thigh with an alcohol needle and then yep. Up. yep, and then stick it in me. Ah, yeah. Eat. Yeah. Cool, thanks. You're welcome. Mrs. Natalie. You're welcome. President oh. of whatever county you're from. You're president. I am very important. What was the shot that I received? I like to know the medical. Geodon. Should that set it set it for me? The officers attempted to understand the situation, but Michael's story was complicated further. I need cigarettes and I need to pick up at 8 a.m. to get some work done. I have played this too many times. 
every I get busted up pretty bad. That was four gentlemen holding me down and me being civil. Yeah, I was like, stand up and put my hands back on, please. That's not staying in the room. That's walking out. Stay in the room. Listen, bud. I'm feeling a little lightheaded. And then go sit on the gown. Gurney. I don't know if there is a gown in here. Gurney. Gurney. But sit on the gurney. I promise you, I am going to follow my visual commands to get some grits in my mouth because they have a new application on their Google function which makes me follow fingers. So if you notice when you were out there and you pointed to me, I have to train their braille system. So part of my functionality is to follow fingers. So I've been walking around with the camera for days looking like a retard following these bumps and they conflict with Tesla's as well as some other app, Boomerang or something they had me download. So I got your visuals and they were close enough to register. And then I saw Braille and it clicked, you're supposed to be registering Braille with left hand today. So that's why that worked. But now I have to use my right eye. Okay. Oh, bro. This, this is the plan. No, Actually, no, ma'am, I'm supposed I to take out my know. hearing aid device. Can you wait until I take out my hearing aid? That's please? a earplug. Yes, Dr. <laughs> Melissa, may I please take out my hearing aid? Sure, go ahead. Take it out. Are you a Dr. McKinney? You, you want to take it out? Take it out. I want the female in the room. No, listen to me. The plan is the doctor wants to, you said, told him you had chest pain. The doctor wants to do some tests to make sure your heart is okay. If your heart is okay, you're going to be discharged. If you don't want to do the testing on your heart, you also are free to go, but you're going to go with them. Okay. But you are going to be discharged at the end of this day. So it's, the choice is ours. So the, the question to you, ma'am, is do you like to The choice is ours. And the reason that I'm asking you is because if no. I get a yes or no directly. No, from sir. You, this, the you choices not, are to like, sit here and get your cardiac so work up and be discharged honestly, with the officer. Honestly, now that we know no, we're stop. both human beings, or you can stop leave. What? I hit a stop sign and I have to stop for now. It's changing because it's 17 seconds today. The question is, today is technically just started. So you guys have 12 hours where I'm under your command if you say that today is your day, correct? Are you going to stay and have this work up for your heart? I'm happy to stay. Okay. I could use a 15 minute smoke break. because I've been not an option. I've been on duty for That's longer than your shift times two. Michael, take your jacket out. Take your arm out, please. Baby, just come over. I like those glasses. I do like to have I've not been allowed to have for over two years. You can't hear me? I'm going to take your phone from the doctor. Turn it down. I'll turn it down for you, bro. Please take your arm out the jacket so you can get some Oh, you know what? Hey, miss, 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 miss. I need to show you why you're so effed up. No. Can I? No, no. Clearly something is wrong. I'd like to show you if you will just stay where you are. No. All I need you to do is just watch and you'll see right. I'm acting strange. Come on, man. I'm going to have to get it off. I'll help myself take the jacket off because the only reason that I have functionality issues right now, help me take the jacket off. You said you would, right? But then you don't know that you take off the button cuffs first. Those were left off because the other guy instructing me is a 12 year old playing video games. But the problem, why everything is so screwed up, about the with four guys right there, is because the a-hole didn't take this off. Look, 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 look. This is still throwing off my blood pressure signal. That, now I am putting pressure on an office from my right. So, if I... They gotta do your blood, man. Nevertheless, Michael's daring actions escalated the situation into chaos. We're going. You know what that means? Relax. Relax. Come on, man. Come on. No, I, I will. We're, we're, we're going to let you charge you if you don't cooperate. Let go of his hand. Let go of his hey, hand. Man. Let go of his hand. Man. Now. Let go. Let go of his hand. You got to tell me the right hand, bro. That's it. That's it. We're All good. right. No. We're not. No. We're done? We're done? I'm Good. Yeah. You. Go. You're under arrest for simple assault. Turn around. Roll over. Roll his over. Roll over, bro. You just grab no nurse like that. Get his hands back here. Yes, sir. I'm trying to roll over. Guys, please remember, I feel this. Yeah. <sighs> 
Michael was charged with simple battery. Fasten your seatbelt to observe how bravery met chaos as two officers fought for their lives against a relentless shooter. On the 11th of June, 2024, deputies with the Blount County Sheriff's Office responded to a welfare check at a residence. Law enforcement arrived, surveyed the area, and suddenly found themselves in an intense, unexpected clash. He just opened the door on us. Uh, we got him at gunpoint and ran back into the house. Come on, fall back, fall back. Shots. We're pinned down behind my vehicle, taking shots. Second house on the right. Can you see him at all? No. Okay. We got no visual. Are you guys No. You see him shoot. During the fierce shootout, law enforcement was severely impacted, appearing helpless against the escalating threat. I need a tourniquet. You got one? Right here. Get it off. Watch the cover us. Stay four. Where you at? Behind his cruiser on the car. Tell her. 
Take more off. Cover. I'm gonna set up the back so we can't come out. Take more. What is that? the officers eagerly awaited assistance. Their composure amidst the chaos was nothing short of extraordinary. Okay. Myself hand 76 hit. We need to get out of here. Do you? Where are you? That's bad. Maybe bull rush right behind my car so we can jump in. We need You got contact? Can we move? Yeah. You all right? 
man. You got it on? Yeah. Are you good? For now. Okay. Get your head down. Okay. 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 Are you ready to move? Yeah. Where are we going? Can we move? Can we move? Get your head down. We need a cruiser to go in and get them out. You still with me? I'm good. Where did you hit? Right above the knee. Me and Corbin are both hit right above the knee. I think mine clawed him. I'm trying to get a cruiser to you. I'm coming up. Desperate for extraction, the deputy's hopes were pinned on the incoming reinforcements. I'm losing my leg, dude. I can't feel it. Stay up, dude. Just... Giving it off the driveway. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> there was the blue. Coming to us. We're behind my, my cruiser in the driveway across the street. I think it came on my feet. Are we moving? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I need help. 
Second, on the right. Hey, Walker. Great four, five, six, four, five, six. Ah! You guys good, Billy? Ah! You're good, you're good. Ah. Okay. Let me help him get out of here real quick. Don't leave your gun. It's mine. Hey, you're good. Fuck! Real six, three, twenty-nine. Really? Is that you? Yeah. Three, forty-three, forty-eight. Okay. Hey, I need a fucking over here. Yo, we can't fucking walk, dude. Yeah. Where are we? 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 I need a call! Come on, come on, come on, this way. We're going this way. Get us a call! You're good, buddy. I got it's you, buddy. This angle. angle. <laughs> well, we had a lot of stuff. We're going down to take him. I want to have a call. Rock! Here. Massive gunfire erupted as cops arrived. Seemingly, Millsaps came prepared, and it was evident. Let's go! Move, 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 move! They moved, I've got them out. The two injured officers are coming around. Ready to go. Ready up here? Yep, who's going to go? Let's go. Get complacent. Let's not get up here. Cross the street on the houses. Millsaps had several charges, seven counts of aggravated assault, two counts of attempted criminal homicide, one count of especially aggravated kidnapping, and four counts of reckless endangerment. Follow these detectives as they stumble upon a trail of peculiar items, turning routine cases into mind-bending mysteries. Unless, I know that bag you just pulled out, I know that's the people we were with. Okay. That's hers. That's, that that's hers? Not, not Kelly's. It's okay, someone The girl that we're with. Okay, no worries. And, and the cooler. And the one toolbox. Yours? No, no. On October 2nd, 2021, officers pulled over a male and female for a traffic violation in Wayne County. The cop gathered information from the woman, and what she provided shifted the direction of the case. Hi, sir. Hi, ma'am. Hello, how's how it going? Good, how are you? The reason I sat you guys is uh, the, the police not coming back to anything. You guys aware of that? I just got this from my daughter. Okay. Um, 
these two rooms at like hours. Yeah, I actually got it played on. Alright, you guys have any IDs on you? I don't have an ID, but I'll take <coughs> all my information. Right, I do I have a felony warrant out of Monroe County. All right, I'm, I'm sure myself in just so you know, but... Okay, I'm amazing. Sure. I appreciate you being straight up with me, okay? What's your warrant for? It's, um, a felony, but what happened is somebody changed the number of my phone and I'm taking the head. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we have your ID as well, sir? Yeah, mind if I shut this off? No, not at all. That'd be great. Actually, just toss the key in the dash for me. Runs that you got it down. I'm just going to have you step out first, okay? okay? Yeah, and fine. then, yeah, if you don't mind, just put the cigarette out. You can place all your property up there for me it's real quick, okay? Because I get cold. No worries. I, I understand. A, I have a bad heart condition, actually. Okay. And just go ahead and place your cigarette on the ground for me. You want me to just put it out over here? Yeah, that'd be I don't want to put amazing. it Amazing. Thank you. I appreciate you being cooperative. Okay, just go ahead and face the car for me. So right now, just because you've been straight up, I'm just going to place you under arrest for that okay. felony warrant, okay? Yep, that's fine. Um, okay, I'm sure that you you said that you were going to get it all worked out with them and whatnot, so... Yeah, I'm trying to, but it's like, it's been a little while now, so if I can get me, I'm fine with it. Okay. Like, I want to get it taken care of. Okay, awesome. So I just have to check with them because it is in our system, okay? Yeah, I'm going to Yeah, I appreciate that because I would have found out anyways, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. But so just hang tight. So that's like I was telling him, I was like, I've been wanting to try Oh. Maybe they won't take <laughs> All right. It's hard with the pandemic, you know, with everything. I understand. And then yeah. she was like, what's the easiest report? And I said, not when you date a maniac. And I come home, I was like, it was a real maniac. What, a, what was mom. it for initially? Initially, I took my mom's big card. Okay. Uh, actually, he did. The guy that I'm with now. This guy? Okay. Yeah, and then what Who is happened? he to you? He's my fiance now. Okay. 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 I'm a loser like that. No, not and at all. Yes, I am, ma'am. I'm, I'm just going to tighten, or, uh, but, uh, what happened is that I, um, I put guilty to it before anybody else could be guilty. Okay. And then, um, we had a jury trial. Yeah. Me and my mom tried a both with the black and the other Okay. And, uh, he didn't show up. Okay, what's your first name? Kelly. Okay, Kelly, you can start with playing on your No problem. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember this answer, I gotta roll that. <laughs> Jeans are always kind of tough for well, me to I'm search anyways. Again, wait, so, uh, You're no, tiny. I, I was a Jeans, so I lost them out. You're tiny. But anyway, what happened is I lost them out. Okay. And then when I really got caught on it, you know, the judge really gave it to me. Yeah. Because I don't mind him. I really don't. But he's like, can I ask you one thing? Were you at this time when you had it? And I said, you know what? I was like, I don't care about that moment. Yeah. I have a real heart. I'm sorry. But she was so thankful I was home with her. Oh, it's my Just friend's time. Yeah. Okay. My, no worries. Thanks to my friends. I didn't take it from her. I was picking up stuff at the store. I came down at the hotel. Okay. What hotel you at? I don't even know. Just checked in. Is right. it like over this way? Yeah. American's Bus? There you go. Yep. Yep. Okay. The pain in the ass to try to figure it out too. <laughs> How long you guys been staying there? We just got there. Like at two in the morning. Like we like we're trying to figure it out all night. Okay. Where are you guys from originally? Um, we are living in the area right now. Pick me. And Monroe County. Maybe okay. Michigan actually. Where? Maybe. Maybe. And I moved away from there because I came home from Monroe. Okay. That's yeah. kind of a cool city name. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe I'm there, maybe I'm not. Any, uh, you have a bra? Yeah. Just a normal one? Yeah, underwear. Okay. You know, I do have six kids. <laughs> six kids? Yeah. Jeez. And that's why everybody says I wore it like a kind of belly shirt today and I'm not like that, but I was you, hot. You, and, uh, you do you, man. But <laughs> I'm just nervous. There's no way you're a grandma. <laughs> that's right, you're going to have two grandmas. Oh, jeez. You're a grandma? Yeah. No kidding. Okay. So just go ahead and hang tight back here. Is it okay heat-wise? I know I cranked the heat, so if you'd like a window down or anything. Yeah, there's a window down. Window down? I'm not going to jump through it, I promise. No, absolutely. After detaining her, the police officer started questioning the driver to learn more about the incident. Excuse me? Hey, Eric, I'm going to have you step out as well for me, okay? You could just put your cigarette out. You can either put it out out here. I don't care. You can walk out with it and toss it. I don't know how you guys both just grab the ash like that, Jesus. <laughs> I know, it's kind of nervous. No, you're okay. My daughters? That's okay, I need. I just need you to step out real quick, okay? We'll, we'll handle vehicle. that in a sec. <coughs> Alright, come back this like way for me. Go ahead and face the vehicle. Okay. Hands behind your back, palms together, like you're praying. Interlace your fingers. All right, you got a couple warrants out of Washtenaw County. Are you aware of them? Yeah, they were not picked up. I mean, okay. they won't come pick me up. Okay, so you've been hooked up on them before? Uh, I just got on them. Yeah. All right, so just because they're in my system, I got to check them out, okay? So I got to contact them. Okay. Anything in the car I should be worried about? I just got all kinds of crap in here because we're kind of moving. Okay, what kind of stuff? Well, I mean, there's clothes and Nothing that I gotta worry about as an officer. Oh. Okay, you good if I go through it? No. You don't care? 
Okay, go ahead and switch. I mean, did, should you ask my daughter? Would there be no, I just got to ask you. I just got to ask you, okay? Go ahead and spread your feet wide for me real quick, okay? How long you had those ones out of wash now? Well, for a while, my ex-wife, we, uh, I had Pessy and our three kids, and she, uh, applied for assistance with her two other ones. Okay. And they, uh, all right. And, uh, I'm just going to toss she, this change back in here for you, okay? Yeah. When she applied, um, I think the Washington County, I she was getting assistance for the other two. Yeah. They had it screwed up. Okay. And had, uh, so I tried to get some child support. Oh, uh, no kidding. So, so they're just uh, child support warrants then? Well, one's child support and then one was, uh, Okay. A weed pipe? Okay. That was bad. Well, I don't know that they were charging you for that. Yeah, right? <laughs> Back in like 2015, man. <laughs> well, whenever you... That's all legal now. When you get to be my age, it's like 2015. Sounds like the other day. 89, 90, and stuff like that. Yeah. All right, I'm going to... Where's that? 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 Are you good with him? Yeah. The officer found a box in the vehicle and asked the man about it, but his answer was suspicious. I got cracked, I got pipes, I got syringes. Fuck. Oh. Oh. Open glass, glass pipes, syringes, anything that's gonna poke me. If there's anything that's in that vehicle, it was either whatever she's just told you, because okay. she obviously could hide it from me. Okay. And, and, and where? Well, that, I mean, unless, I know that bag you just pulled out, I know that's the people we're with. Okay. That's hers. That's that. That's girl's. hers? Not not Kelly's. That's okay, the girl else's. that we're with. Okay, no worries. And, and the cooler and the one toolbox. Yours? No, those ones aren't mine. Those are the people that we're with that's at the room. Okay, what about the lockboxes? Yours? Oh, uh, I don't have a lockbox. Okay. Was it in, with like, in the back seat? No, it was kind of like right by you. In the front? Or 42. 42. It, yeah, it was like in the middle. It was in your reach, okay? Okay, yeah, but uh, no, I don't have one. I just, I literally just don't want to get stuck. Yeah, no, That's I don't. like him and I's biggest fear. If we get stuck, it's going to be a bad day for well, all of us. that's, uh, well, I'm kind of disappointed. Okay. Yep. The law enforcers also discovered a bag filled with items and decided to inspect everything. Yeah, he, neither of them are admitting to the lockboxes. They're saying, so they stay at America's Best. Yeah, that's what he said. And they said that all these things back here are not theirs, but it's in their reach, so I don't care. They're going in. 
Oh, is this a CCW Savage? Better believe it is. It's a K bar. I can't hear you. Huh? Five inches or four inches? It's gotta be about three. Easy. There's just a bunch of Jeez. taking that. Oh, we'll mess with that now before. I'm just scared for what else is here. Yikes. Crack pipe. <laughs> now it's an actual tire pressure gauge. Shocker. Roaches. This one's legal. Yeah, You need some nipple tassels, Savage? I know. I'm pretty sure that yours are probably getting a little old. Alright, there's a f like wedding rings and f Do you think they steal them? Should I just leave it all? That it does. This is a. I'm not gonna lie. Did he give you some stuff today? Yep. Say yes, sure. Doesn't matter, I found that fold, so oh, yeah. I saw the fold. I was just curious because I thought you asked Yeah, I did. He said, yep, sure. I said, okay, thanks. Bro, there was so much f***ing gushers. I just had a pack. Honestly, it's open up that pocket and just fucking start mixing things around. She is right stripper, I'm assuming. America's best is the place. Can you just fold that? And I'm just gonna check it. <laughs> the situation became more complicated when the cops found a locked box and more bags in the back of the vehicle. I'll just do it at the station. I think that's probably the best that this is going to do there. Yeah, um, let me just... 
That has paraphernalia on it. I know. I'm just gonna measuring cup. The needles. I am going to. This is oh. fine. It doesn't have a needle. <laughs> watch yourself. Before you watch yourself. Leave the plunger. I don't give a. Don't give a. What is this? The weeds. Is that weeds? Yeah. It's not like a crocodile or something. <laughs> I don't know if I know what that looks like, homie. Yeah. Poor Gojer. I can't wait to get stuck and get the pin and hopefully die. <laughs> 50 needles are located. <laughs> this is gonna be so up to tag. Do you know how many evidence tags I gotta do because all our different places. Yeah, this was found in here. Okay, so... Do you have more evidence bags? Yeah, do you have any more? Take your time, I got one more. They were five of the organ the Huh? Five of the organ the fuck out of the car. You are? Yeah. Alright, so trunk in silver box. Yeah. What's in here? What more shit can you guys find here? Uh three dirty. Oh beautiful. Perfect timing. Love it. Love to see it. I love my job. Sheesh. What a smell. They're disinfecting stuff at least. Do you need a suppository? I bet she goes in inside of her. God, tiger. Tiger bomb. Da 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 da! Oh. If they're not their names, we have to take them. Old man names. What the f <laughs> What the f This is in a bag. I hope it's just some time. Bro. Eric Mays. Okay, that's his. <laughs> These things look old as dirt. Okay, at least I can tag or put that this was by this and this all has his name on it, so he can't tell me this in the trunk. Is it his? That's true. Okay, medication that has his name on it. This one's not even the scripts. Brandon Ewing. That's not him. Nope. That's not what he does. That's Trezodone. With some other pills in here. I see one. This is f***ing Eight. Uh, keep your little orange one out of there. The man and woman were charged with possession of controlled substances and drug paraphernalia, and she also had a warrant. Watch this man trying to outrun the authorities, only to find himself trapped in a complex situation. It's not as cold as it was, but we're also doing blankets right now. So. As long as I can get a blanket in your sleep, that's all I care about. <laughs> Anything in your pockets? No. I don't believe nature of everything. On November 7th, 2023, the officers found a vehicle in Ohio that had an associated warrant and initiated a traffic stop. As the cops searched for the suspects, he came across a suspicious car in the parking lot. Still going west past the end of the No traffic, speed's 43. Still west on Waterloo. Come out to the railroad tracks, no traffic, speed 45. Still no traffic, come out to Wintergreen, speed 40. No cars on the road. Come out 
So Wingate, speed 40, still west on Waterloo. Traffic still west on water. This is 44. 43, let me know if he's making any traffic violations. Copy, we'll still be going west on water. We're coming up to 27. We're getting all green lights right now. Speed 42. Coming up to 30th Street. Going south on 30th. Signaling to turn to left. Put your stuff on. Turn around! I'm right. The police quickly engaged with Terrell and used smart moves to detain the suspect. Put your hands on your head! Do not reach into your Don't reach! No! No! Put your hands on your head! Hey, Smith, go! Hey, stay over there! Stay over there! Do not come over here! Come on, let's go! Stay where you're at! Yeah, it's, in, it's back in my hat. Help him with this. Hey, let me get my stuff, I don't, I don't need to come and get anything out of the car. Yeah, one of y'all come and get my stuff, please. Stay over there. You guys stay over there. Nobody wants to come over here. Nobody wants to come over here. I don't even. There's nothing in the car. Like, I don't. I don't uh, okay, move into the car. And if one of y'all please pull my pants up. Please and thank you. To the car, pat him down. Check it. I just came here because I wanted everybody. I work here, so I just wanted everybody to see me. What'd you run for? I, I seen you the I, other night, I, man. I didn't <clears throat> run for anything. You got any weapons right. on you? No, I don't. Anything illegal in the building like that? No, I don't. Did you have some post bus or anything like that? No. Like I said, I just came here. Go ahead and spread your here. feet for me. Like I said, I just came here because I work here. I, I don't even know. I 
I said I wasn't running. I was just coming to my job. Well, you were running because you didn't stop. I, I was crazy. crazy how we tried happens, to stop right? you all the way back in Maine. And once again, I wasn't running. I, it's I just, running. It's so absolutely. You, so you just I, drove around the cruiser I, I, and you weren't running. Yeah, he cut me off. It's not cutting you off. He had his lights on. He cut me off. No, we didn't cut you off. That's not how that works. Okay. Okay. That's, that's so don't fine. get don't no, get smart. I'm, I'm not. I'm just saying. You were I'm running. So yeah. congratulations. This is where we're at. When officers searched Terrell, they were taken aback by the shocking discoveries. Hey, I'm the transport officer. I gotta pay you down. I know these officers are pay you down. You have anything on you that they missed? No knives, guns, drugs, needles, anything like that? Nothing can harm me? Okay. I appreciate being cooperative, okay? You have to get all your pockets. The only thing I ask is when you're done, can I? Like, I'm just gonna fill my pants up. Bro. Yeah, I'll pull those up, okay? Yeah, shit cost me like 250 bucks. I'm so mad, bro. Yeah. Yes, yeah, my shit. Come on. A little tough to pull up, man. I'm about to unbuckle that. Then y'all be able to pull it up. You want me to unbuckle that? Yeah. And then, then it should be able to go straight up. I'll fix it after I'm done patching down, okay, man? That's fine. I work with you. Got something in your pocket. Yeah. So lighter they won't allow, you won't be allowed to have. That's fine. This should be fine. I'm put if this I can, in this can I use that one more time when I get in? Let me show you off the camera. The cha chapstick should be fine, man. Is that what you're talking about? I got a bag. Yeah. I got all your money in your phone in there. Is there a way that I can get my money to her? Can y'all tag me? I just want to be able to get out with a fine without my mom being on a card. I don't want that. If I can, chaos. What do you want to do with the money? I want to give it to her if I can. Okay. Her? Yeah, if y'all get counted or whatever, I, I just want to be able to give it to somebody yeah, trying to I get just, out. I just counted it. That's fine. I'll give her the that's, that's fine. That's fine. All right. Listen, let me know how much it is. All right, man. Yeah, I'm going to switch handcuffs. These officers yeah. can have their handcuffs back. Is there anything on you I missed, man? No. Okay. It's going to be a little uncomfortable. It's going to get better. That's First set's coming off. It's gonna be real uncomfortable, man. I got it. Yeah. Some of these. You don't have to take her out to tell her to come get that money. What, what do you want, man? Yeah, you do. Go try. Is that better? If you can, I have it. Lo I have it loose, but I, you're just gonna have to face this way with it, okay, man? Yeah, I have it loose. The only way would be I'd have to take it all the way off. As long as I can twist it in right, that's all I care about. Okay. So nothing else I missed? No, not at all. Okay. So you step on out. Watch your hand up there. Okay, twist this other one for me. I'll be over here just like this. I don't need no What's problem. that? You can take. Okay. Can, can you have, can you give her my ring too? The ring? Yes. If it come off, you'll get a tough ring in the pan. All right. Terrell found himself in a difficult spot as he dealt with the repercussions of his misdeed. Yeah, these roads are bumpy. Y'all should be taking it slow. Times. I saw you bouncing around a little. Pull these pants up. You got it. I'll put 
put in the notes of your computer cooperative right now, okay? I don't know if that'll help much, but. All right. It's not as cold as it was, but we're also doing blankets right now. So as long as I can get a blanket in there, that's all I care about. <laughs> Some officers don't, and I found weed oh, in our drugs. Always, always, always in the shit. Yeah. 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 There's a bunch of pockets. <laughs> I, I believe I checked them all, but there, there was a lot. Yeah. That's it. Don't want to mess up. you can't have, man. So, uh, <laughs> they, like, I need it anyway. When do you left hand first? I don't know. Neville was arrested for warrants as well as having weapons while under disability and willful flee. We've seen cops in action against criminals. Now witness how police rush to aid when people require help, extending a helping hand to communities in need. You want to talk about what we found in the vehicle? What is on? Okay. Well, before this, I'm going to advise you of your rights, all right? Okay. Doesn't mean you're under arrest or you're going to jail or nothing like that, okay? So if you got any questions, when I'm done, ask. All right. Yeah, you right to remain silent. Do you understand that? Yeah. On the 7th of January, 2024, the deputies were dispatched after receiving a call from a woman named Lindsay regarding her husband's disappearance in Plains Road, Ohio. Upon reaching the spot, the deputy started an inspection and sensed something amiss. Okay. Whose gun is this? I think it's ours. Okay. I hear the keys here. Thank you.
How many sets of keys? Just one. That's his truck key that's at our house. Okay. What's what's your husband's name? Charles. He goes by Chuck Humphrey. What's his addiction? Um, it was heroin. Uh huh. And I'm pretty sure he's using fentanyl now. Fentanyl? Yeah, he usually uh uses a needle. Okay. Yeah. There's a white powder substance in the wash rag. In the lighter. So he left yesterday, you said? Yeah, around 1.15. He was supposed to go get our kids some medicine. Uh huh. Because both of our kids are sick. But he didn't come back. And I haven't heard from him since then. Is this his phone in the console here? Yeah, it should be. It's going straight to voice now though, so I have to be off. I mean, I have a picture of him if you need it. Not that one. I know, I'm just going okay. to check and see. Are you Melody? No. Who's Melody? I have no idea. Well, that uh, mocks the ceiling for <laughs> melody. <clears throat> Soon, the officers attempted to gain more insights regarding the mysterious event, uncovering intriguing developments. Is your kids with you? No, okay. they're at the walls. I just happened to be coming home from the store and sell my car here. We don't live far from here. You think this is your guys' gun? But you're not 100% sure? I mean, I know it's ours. I just, I'm not, I don't know why he has it. I thought it was in our safe at home. And I thought I saw a, something on the back floorboard. Um, uh, 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 it's like a, um, Pretty heavy. I don't have a key for that. Have you ever seen that before? Yeah, I, I think it's one of ours also. I've got to see, but okay. I'm, I'm going to guess there's ammo in it by yeah. the weight of it. Okay. You want to grab some bags? Yeah. It's in there. My wallet is in the center console. Okay. I imagine he's probably pretty high right now. Is that the short number now? I have a serial number. Zero eight seven nine seven. Zero eight seven nine seven. You said this was yours? Would this be your? Yes. Okay. 
I'm going to open it up. Just That's to, fine. It opens on the other side. Just to make sure yeah. there's nothing stuffed in here that's not supposed to be. Yeah. Did you have any cash or anything in here? Uh, no, I don't believe so. Okay. All right, you want to look at that, make sure that everything's there that's supposed to be there? Is this the first time he's done something like this? I mean, there's times that he's been gone for a while, but he's usually home by four or five. Um, but he's been in rehab a couple different times. Uh-huh. Are these keys that you recognize? Um, yeah, those go to our house. Their garage. Okay. Yeah. There's a... I don't know what that is. You don't know what that powder is? No. I'm showing a stolen gun with a serial number of... It's stating that it's a 303 caliber blued woodstock full form woodstock. No. That's not blued. That's not a woodstock. Okay, this isn't a woodstock. Just five five six, so well, that was a three oh eight they said. So. Law enforcement conducted an exhaustive search of the Honda pilot. Did they uncover any hidden secrets? So we'll put this up front so you're transported yes. properly. You said that these are your keys? Yeah, those are two. Okay, you can have those in. Okay. That powder up there almost looks like, it's got a red tint to it. So it almost looks like Kool-Aid or like a thing you- Like a water. Like uh, you put in water, yeah. yeah. you know if any of those keys are not the- Do you mind? No. What'd you say your husband's name was again? Charles. He goes by Chuck. Humphrey? Here. What's that? The keys to that's got to be in here. Keys to what? That box. Hmm. I can imagine you take a lock off here. Yeah. And none of these ones went to it.
Does everything back here look normal? Yeah. Okay. I hope it's a stuff with pine Yeah, that's... there. You wanna... I mean, I don't really see anything. Okay, well, I want to... Oh. Wait, you more than welcome to it. Check it to see if uh, there ain't nothing in there it's supposed to be that I identify. Take one, take a look at that, and you have somebody can come get this. I mean, really, he's not even parked in the park spot. I know. You see the car was running when you got here? Yeah. I, I tried to take keys out of it. Do you want me to go in and see if he's in there? Good. I have a code 58 forty. Wait for the After a thorough inspection, deputies located Charles, expressing concern and outlining their imminent course of action. My father in law is on his way. Okay. We don't lose five for the here. We were at 36 Okay, fine. Well, he's coming to nothing else. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 75 at White Road, 75 White Road, right at the corner of Taylor Road and White, right before the county line. That dispatcher trying to get further. You're clear. Uh, okay. Um, they're in the store with the right now. Hey buddy, real quick. Yeah. What's your name, partner? Chuck. Chuck. Chuck needs you to come with me, bub. What's up? Well, we found some drugs in your car, okay? In my car? Yeah. So just do me a favor, just set those down somewhere. What did you do in my car? Your wife gave us permission to search it, so just set those down. I'm gonna explain that to you. I just want you to come talk to me for a second. So, so I'm not gonna cuff you or anything because we're walking out. But right now you're being detained. So if you run, it's gonna be fleeing, okay? That's a felony. How are we going? Good, how are you? Not too bad. So what's going on today? Just getting to head home. Okay. We've been fighting and I didn't want to go home last night. So, okay. You know, I didn't do anything, you know, but I'm running, causing problems or anything. So. Well, no one said you were, but you know, obviously your wife's a little concerned because you, you didn't come home. Um, why she knew you left to get the kids some medicine? No, that's not true. What's that? That's not true. Okay. Well, um, 
You want to talk about what we found in the vehicle? When he's on. Okay. Well, before I do so, I'm going to advise you of your rights, all right? Okay. Doesn't mean you're under arrest or you're going to jail or nothing like that, okay? So if you got any questions, when I'm done, ask. All right? Okay. Yeah, right to remain silent. Do you understand that? Yeah. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. Do you understand that? Yeah. Have a right to your lawyer and have it with you while I be in question. Do you understand that? Yeah. If you can't afford a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you if you wish. Do you understand that? You can decide any time to exercise those rights, not answer any questions, to make any statements. Do you understand okay. that? Okay. So, your wife found your vehicle here. All right. It was out here running. So that was odd that you ain't been home for a while, all right? So she got in the vehicle and she found some questionable items and she called us, all right? One of those is a little mason jar that had some white powder in it, all right? And there's a burnt spoon in there and a lighter and some medication that belongs to somebody else. Medication belongs to somebody else. Yeah, so um, antibiotic. in there. That's, that's, I didn't know that was in there. Didn't know that was in there, yeah. uh, the antibiotic? Yeah. What, what about the, the little jar of powder? Uh, I don't know where it goes. You know where it goes? Okay. <clears throat> what do you mean by you know where it goes? During questioning, police voiced their skepticism, concluding the conversation without raising alarm. I have a problem that you've had some issues trying to stay off of, right? Okay. Have you ever been arrested for anything like that before? Okay. Are you currently on probation or parole or anything? Okay. All right. Have you used today? Okay. What's that? Not today, no. Not today, no? Sir. Okay. You no, use I smoke my vape while I'm standing here. What? Just vape right there. Just, just wait till we're done speaking, if you don't mind, please. Yeah. Okay. So, did you use yesterday? Yeah. Okay. You have a counselor that you see for this? All right. Yeah, the, uh, I need to get back in. Well, what about the gun that was in there, too? What about it? Is that yours? Ours. Hers, yours? I mean, you're both married. So, I mean, but it was in the vehicle but beside the drugs, right? The reason that you got a weapon in a vehicle like that? Uh, no. Consider so selling it. We're kind of hard up for money right now. Okay. Things ain't going very good. But from what I was told, she wanted, you know, she was leaving, so. Okay. How long have you been here? 15 minutes. Even. Well, what are you doing here? Pick something up? Yeah. yeah. Anything? So I got my suspicions on what that powder is, but exactly what is it? I'll just make this real quick. Chuck, buddy, so this is what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm just going to take some of information for you, okay? Um, I really appreciate it to talk to talk to these detectives. So there's there's three different ones that's most likely going to be. I can't say which one it is. I'm going to talk to them tomorrow when I come in for work. Um, I hope you don't change your mind. I'm trying to help you. So uh, first, I just want to make sure I got a good address for you. So seven two zero. Yeah, cool. Um, so that that I know even though you told me what it is, it will be sent off for testing. Um, at this time, you, you, you might get charged with possession on this, but this has got in my hands, and that's another reason I'm gonna ask that you talk to them. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this number and tell them what we talked about to these detectives, and uh, they're gonna reach out to you and have a conversation, okay? So Chuck, I appreciate you being with me, buddy. Um, that's why you're not in the handcuffs or anything. You're not going to jail. So we're trying to even be foolish. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I appreciate you speaking with me. So you have a good one, Chuck. Uh, if you need it, this is for any reason, just call. Okay. okay, thank you. The police didn't bring any charges against Charles. To unlock more thrilling crime investigations like these, hit the subscribe button.